Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So in this video, I want to talk about choices and decisions and why they are your friend and why you should embrace having more choices. If you're interested in a video like that, please keep watching. So you guys, welcome back to the channel. So like I said, I want to talk about choices and decisions in this video and having an abundance of choices. So the last two videos I talked about um, having a, a pool of suitors when it comes to dating and things like that and why having choices is feminine energy and femininity. And so I want to go a little deeper into this, um, this conversation because, you know, I talked about in my last video, um, you know, rotational, I say you know a lot, but rotational dating and having a pool of suitors is really a feminine energy type of way to live your life, to navigate the world. And it also is about making good, sound decisions for your life. Now, I want to take that part and really dive into that because I think it's really important that we talk about this. <laughs> Very redundant. Like I said in the past videos, I think it's important for us as women to start having these conversations because we need to. We really, truly need to. So you do not know who I am. My name is Amber Turner and I am the author of You Choose Your Outfit. And outfit is a metaphor for your reality and experience, also your self-identity. And it's interesting that we're going to talk about choice um, and having an abundance of choices. And that's why I'm a big proponent for rotational dating where you have a pool of suitors and you have the opportunity to make the right decision for your life. And why is this important? Why is it important to have a lot of choices and the ability to decide for your life? I wrote the book, You Choose Your Outfit, because you really truly choose. And a lot of people believe that that's not the case. Now, we think about choices and decisions. Oh, let me just say, if you think about your life right now in the present now, your life really truly is a reflection of a series of decisions and choices you have made up until this point in the present now. Whether you went to work or you decided to take that job or you decided to go to college or you decided to go with that man and you made the choice, whatever the choice, whatever it was, your life is a reflection of all of these series of choices and decisions you have made. Okay, so if our life is a series, if our life is a reflection of a series of choices and decisions we've made, wouldn't it make sense for us come from a place of having an abundance of choices and decisions to make from? Now, anytime we make a decision or a choice, there is a thought that precedes that decision or choice. Now, when it comes to dating and deciding on a partner for your life and someone you want to build a life with, uh, build a home with, build a family with, uh, you know, build money with, all sorts of things that you'll do with a partner, right? You have to think when it comes to making a decision, you're either choosing from a a, a lack standpoint or an abundant standpoint. But you have to think about, is this the best choice for me for the vision and the goals that I have for my life? Now, oftentimes people would what a lot of people say settle because they believe that this is the only choice that they have. And when you look at the thought that's prior to this, this is the only choice that I have, you're coming from a lack mindset, right? So if you believe that the world is your oyster and the world is abundant and there's plenty of men that are, are available to me, there's plenty of things that I can choose from, you're coming from an abundance mindset. That is a big reason why I'm such a proponent for rotational dating 
and having a dating pool of potentials because you are operating from a place of abundance versus a place of lack. And you don't want to navigate and, you know, honestly, uh, navigating your like living in feminine energy is not about lack. It is all about abundance. Think about how women are, right? We always want more. Oftentimes women can go to extremes because we want more. That's how we are. We want to go to the next level. We want more. More. That is part of our being. That's part of being in feminine energy. And if you are operating from a state of lack, that is not operating in feminine energy. And you have to see life in the abundance that it is. The world is truly your oyster. And I wonder where that saying comes from. That's an interesting, I have to look that up. But the world truly is your oyster. Navigating your life from abundance means making good, sound decisions. Again, our life right now, my life right now, and the present now is truly a series of choices and decisions that I've made. It is a reflection of the decisions and choices that I've made that have led to my present now. And that is why it is important to know and understand the truth that you have an abundance of choices. And oftentimes when people are operating from a place of lack, they think that they, there's no other choice. They think this is the only man they can get. They think this is the only job that they can get. This, that they can't do certain things because this is the only choice for them. But it's truly not. It is not. You have to move and understand that the world is abundant, that you have an abundance uh, you have an abundance of choices and decisions that you can make that is best for your life. And that's how you get what you want. You know, I talk about you choose your outfit. I wrote the book, You Choose Your Outfit. Now, if you have a wardrobe with only one outfit and you think that's the only outfit that exists, you're going to move in the world with that just that one outfit on. Instead of going shopping, girlfriend, go shopping. Go shopping, right? And understand that, oh, there's Neiman's, there's people like Zara, I'm not, I'm not the biggest fan of Zara, but like there's so many different styles, there's so many different stores in which you can shop at, there's so many different things in which you can wear. But oftentimes, the thing with people in this, like that's why it is, it is truly important for you to understand that you have choices and why you should have a pool of potentials and come from a place of abundance and choose from a place of abundance. Decide for your life from a place of abundance. And this is how you make the best choice and decision for your life is when you truly understand this, that you have an abundance of choices and decisions in which you can make for your life. You ain't got one outfit in that closet, girlfriend. You don't have one outfit. You have an abundance, infinite choices of outfits in which you can wear, okay? So that's why it's important to, to come from a place of pool of potentials, rotational dating, and understanding abundance, and choosing from a place of abundance, deciding from a place of abundance not lack. That's why it's so important. So I did the video to set up what engagement is. Check out that video, please, and how to choose from a, a place of abundance. I did a video on why perhaps you don't want to or you reject the idea of rotational dating and having a pool of potential. Now, this is why this is another video in this series that's giving you more insight into choosing from a place of abundance. Your life is a reflection of all of the choices and decisions you have made up until now. Now choose from a place of abundance. Understand that you have infinite choices and decisions you can make and choose.
like this is real. And so anytime, like even with myself, I understand um, I did a video on cycles. Okay. So things will come back around in life. And I understand, okay, this thing is coming back around. I can make the same decision that I did before, which is going to yield the same result. Or I can choose from a state of abundance and choose something different. It's infinite choices. I can choose something different and then my life will transform from there. I mean, I can go into the numerology of it all, the mathematics of it all, but you have to understand it is somewhat of a mathematical equation, right? It's like, it is somewhat of a mathematical equation because if you continue, two plus two will always equal four. If you continue to make the same choices, you will always get the same result. But two plus four equals six you're going to get a different result if you put something different in the equation part, right? The same thing. It's the same kind of thing. I mean, I'm trying to keep it practical. We can go into the, the quantum physics of it all, but that if you can see it that way, you'll understand that, okay, I have to make a different choice here. And not only that, there's infinite choices in which I can make and choose from okay to really transform my life to get the thing that I want to get the thing that I desire okay so I really wanted to share this with you guys you choose your outfit you choose and you can go beyond what's in your closet girlfriend okay you can choose whatever makes you feel good. If it's sexy, if it makes you feel sexy, if it makes you feel luxurious, if it makes you feel confident, you put on a power suit, if that makes you feel confident, wear it. Wear it, okay? Anyways, guys, that is all for this video. We do have a few things. Okay, Impact You, we are coming up with a curriculum of transformation, which we are, I feel so good about. This is what I teach in Manifesting Made Basic, and this curriculum really can transform your life. And I'll go deeper into, I'll probably do another video on it because I don't want to make this video too long, but there is a mathematical equation to transformation. And if you truly desire transformation for your life, I do invite you guys to check out Manifesting Made Basic. Um, but we will also, this is a concept in which we are going to be teaching and impact you and build a curriculum around. If you truly desire change, if you truly desire a shift for your life, transformation, this is it. This will change your life. So I invite you guys to check out Impact You. I'm going to leave the link below for that as well. We're going to have Manifesting Made Basic in Colorado Springs. I will be teaching the workshop live. We have 16 spots left. I'll leave the link below for that as well. We got some events coming through Impact You Speaks. We're, it's, it is truly amazing. I am incredibly grateful to, to be able to um, build this curriculum in which I really truly feel will change people's lives and I'm so excited for it. So anyways, you guys, that's all for this video. I will check you guys in the next video. And also if you want to, uh, if you want to want to check out some more things about feminine energy and how you can embrace your feminine energy, you can check out my website. I'll leave the link below. That's kind of outside of impact you impact you is more about transformation overall. And I'm a big proponent for embracing your feminine energy, living a softer, peaceful life. That's what I'm about. So if you want to find out some more resources about that, you can check out the links below as well. Anyways, guys, that's all. I will check you guys in the next video. Peace.